Hi guys, welcome back to Cisco Nate, and in today's episode I'm going to show you how to definitively diagnose the reason for failure of an upgrade of FMC. Whether it's physical or virtual, the, the methodology for determining the failure is the same. So we'll go ahead and get right into that. Okay, so on this fresh FMC V that I just installed, uh, I'm going to induce a failure to upgrade and show you guys how to definitively figure out what happened, why the upgrade failed, rather than just that innocuous upgrade failed message that you can get. So I'm gonna come here and I'm gonna to try to install 6.6 on an AWS instance. Now, some of you may already know that this is impossible as of right now, and that's because there is a memory check that occurs that tries to check and make sure that you have enough memory allocated. And the current instance types that are available do not actually have the 28 gigabytes of uh, memory that is required. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell it to uh, do an install. And part of the install, it actually runs right in this check in the background. But what I want you guys to see is it will fail. And when it does, we're gonna go looking through the logs to find the exact message why. So I'm gonna go ahead and stop the recording here and we'll come back once it's failed. All right, so as you guys can see here, the uh, install has actually failed. It's got a little piece of toast here, fatal error. So I'm going to go look at the uh, task. It says fatal error running script, minimum 28 gigs RAM needed. Oh, so this is good. They're actually starting to reflect some of the detailed logs up here telling you exactly why it failed. Now, if you want to actually go verify this yourself, or if you just get a generic fail message, you can come in through SSH here. Uh, SSH into the device, which you see I've already done here, var log SF, and then now that I've tried to do an upgrade, there's an upgrade file here. So I'm going to go ahead and see into that file or uh, directory, and then I can look at the upgrade status stat log. So cat upgrade status stat log, and tells you it's a lot of 15 gigs of RAM, it needs more. Um, so that's more of a summary. The, the main upgrade script is where you'll see the best info. And you can see your fatal error during 28 gigs of RAM needed. So that's it. Uh, if you guys ever want to see detailed information on why an upgrade failed, this is how you do it. var log SF on the FMC. Um, there will be a video to follow up on what happens if an FTD upgrade fails. All right, have a good one, guys. Talk to you later.